Hey, happy weekend to you. Welcome back to Bruce with Beck. I'm Dan. How the hell are you? I'm fine. Maybe good. I'm excellent. All right. Uh, I was asked to do Miller High Life as a review, which I have not done yet, and got to do it. Perfect day to do it on the weekend. So, um, this is from Miller Brewing Company out of Milwaukee, Wisconsin, a subsidiary of Molson Coors. Um, Miller High Life, I'm going to read, is also known, of course, as the Champagne of Beers, uh, as a quintessential classic, American-style lager. Uh, continues to be faithfully brewed as a golden pilsner, utilizing light, stable Galena hops from the Pacific Northwest and a select combination of malted barley. Now, I had to look back at what Galena hops will give you. Um, sweet fruit is peaches, pears, citrus elements like grapefruit, lime, pineapple. Other aromas may include spicy woodiness, black currant, caddy, and gooseberry. Uh, the bitterness is considered clean and mellow. All right, so that's kind of what they're rolling on, along with their select combination of malted barley. Um, I did look, apparently, I can't remember if it says it on here. But I looked it up because I was, you know, certain uh, subscriber uh, always has asked what, what's in certain uh, uh, domestic light beers and regular beers. This apparently contains water, barley malt, corn syrup, maltose, yeast, and hop extract. Now, what it's been explored about hop extract is it's a natural, uh, it's a natural pres pres preservative. So uh, I did not even know that until I looked it up. Uh, and then obviously you've got the corn syrup, but which is not high fructose corn syrup. So it's just, it's, it's, it's not going there. Uh, anyway, classic. So let's get to it. Shall we? I've, I, I got the double Dutch, so we got to do this. Oh, excuse me. And I didn't have my Richter button cause it's back in Houston. Left it there. 4.6 on the Richter. Ding. Thanks Bronco Bob. All right, let's do this. Let's pour it. And please do me the usual usual appreciated favor while I pour, please crush that like button, por favor, gracias, and if you haven't already subscribed, please subscribe, that way you can see all these classic beers all the damn time, all right, all right, all right, please like and subscribe, Bronco Bob says thank you very much, ding, <coughs> get that out of me, all right, take this one off here, boom, what I would uh, come to expect, nice see-through, nice looking lager, just a little bit ahead. All right, I haven't had one of these in a while, so let's dig in and see how I feel about it. Uh, aroma check. Yeah, I feel like I can smell a little bit of the, uh, the sweetness from the, maybe a little bit of the corn syrup. Um, what else was it? The, no. Oh. Like again, I doubt it's going to be as, because I remember liking this beer, so not going to be as bad as uh, one of those malt liquors I had that, um, yeah, really too sweet. So no words or emotions. Let's get the champagne of uh, all beers. Nice. Clean. Easy going barley. Do I get that Galena hop um, factor? I wouldn't say I really get. It says you might get peach or pears. Maybe a little bit of a, like a pear flavor. Maybe. Um, might get a little lime. Maybe, maybe a little like subtle pineapple, but not really very subtle. This is just clean, good, good, bar, good, uh, you know. Bread Z barley, if you want to call it that. Grainy barley. But that's nice. That's nice. Um, oh, yeah. One more thing. The uh, the spicy woods, wood, wood, I can't even say it. Woodiness. I'm, I'm a grown man. Thank you. I mean, they're wrong. It, I literally just get clean, good going down, uh, not sweet actually, and just, just like a nice, nice, easy going barley flavor. All right, let's top it back up. 
There you go. Cheers. Subscribe and like. Thank you. All right. Let's let's get a little bit more, and then I'm going to shock you with something else. Yeah, everything I've said. It's it. You get little subtle factors of like lime and um, maybe pear and pineapple, but like again, it's really just clean domestic mm. beer with a, a, a nice light barley. Taste to it is that that is all right. So Miller High Life. Okay. Love that I'm drinking the champagne of beers on a phenomenal weekend. All right. So here's another shocker. Forgot my board and my bell and my marker in Houston. Uh, had to hop on a flight. Just forgot all of it, but it, it, it'll get to me soon enough. But anyway, from stellar down to hell no, I'm just going to not even circle it. But I gotta, let's see. I, really, I mean, like, I do like this. It's got a little bit more body um, to it than, like, like a, a lot, you know, a light beer. That's why it's high, high life. Um, does it feel 4.6%? I mean, hell, it could. I could see this being 5% or 5.2. But I mean, actually, you know, it, it does come off really smooth. So, so that's about right. That's what I would guess if I was maybe like four or seven. Um, Mouth feel is like very easy going, like 15%. So from Stowe down to hell no, this one, is going to be tip top end of drinkable. I would give this uh, either 78 or 79 out of 100. I mean, nothing wrong with it. Nothing too much with the flavor. A little bit better than some of the other light beers, but yeah, it's nice. And 10.99 a 12 pack. <laughs> bargain. Um, all right then. So 78 or I'll give it a 79. This is 79 C plus. Uh, it, it, it is dr very high end drinkable. Uh, good value though. Good value. Like I said, go get yourself a, a nice 12 pack of this for 10.99. Um, uh, I've got a couple other reviews coming up, including, I think I'm finally going to incorporate the bomb. You're going to see me taste the bomb on here. I might even just have a nice casual uh, Miller High Life. Don't know if I'm going to have like a couple chicken nuggets or something like that. I'm going to put my regular hot sauce on one and then I'm going to put the bomb on the other. So that's coming up. And I've also got um, another from Mother Earth that's new. It's got like a blood, it's like a blood orange double IPA. Uh, could be interesting. So anyway, cheers to you. Remember to like and subscribe. Really appreciate it. Really appreciate it. Like and subscribe. Thanks much. Let Ruck, can you say, let, let Russ cook. Go to Maui. What up, buffs? All right. See you out there.